Greetings, sir and sirettes, and welcome back to Robocraft and part two of the Ostotskan Hawk, rather than the badly named Ostotskian Hawk. I don't really know why I wanted to add an I so badly last time, but that's been removed. And we have we have refined the design. As you can see, it looks a lot more like the Ostotskan Hawk symbol. I did try and do the beak, which is there in the original um, image, but sadly in Robocraft it doesn't turn out too well, at least at this size. I'm sure if you made it bigger, perhaps in a higher tier, it would be easier to do, but I kept trying different ways and it kept looking like it was either a bird holding a cigarette or simply some form of deformed dodo head. Regardless, it didn't turn out too well. But here's the finished design um, in the very end of tier 5, and one thing I'm very happy about is other than the blue blocks, this is completely suitable for the tier it's in. There's nothing wrong with it at all, it's all available in tier 5 other than the blue blocks, making it pretty much not over tiered in any way, which I think, which is a nice thing in my opinion. I don't always do this, I don't always stick to this rule, but when I, if I can, I will try to avoid over tiering a robot by too much. I don't find it too enjoyable, it's one of the reasons why my little baby grinder here barely ever gets played because of the over-tiered rail. Although since the rail nerf, he's actually a lot less effective. So that could be another reason. Maybe I'm just a terrible, terrible loser. Who knows? But still, yeah, so that's the finished design. We've had some backwards thrusters because, um, well, I've actually played this in a live stream. They should be going out before the live stream segment, hopefully. It'll be part two of the live stream upload. Um, I found out that this thing can get stuck quite easily on, let's say, a rock or something if it's facing directly forward and can simply not get back up into the air because the thrusters at the front are simply not powerful enough to lift the sheer amount of metal that makes the, the hawk's wings. So that is actually such a good addition, it's unbelievable. Just the ability to go backwards even slightly really, really helps. Um, what else have we done? Uh, obviously the shape's changed. We have only five guns down from the six that the Arstotskan Glory had, sorry, Arstotskan Hawk had, um, which is a little bit bad because we can be kind of, we, we can be kind of um, declawed quite easily, I find. But I do think it's worth it for the shape. I'd have to um, put a gun on top, which really would, it wouldn't weaken the down, well, yeah, it would actually weaken our downwards fire because occasionally one of the guns would simply shoot into the air, not at our target. So that's pretty much that. It also shoots forward exceedingly well, which is always good on an interceptor, or so I'm told, being able to shoot other flyers. Generally a helpful thing. So without further ado, we're going to go into a match and hopefully spread the Arstotskan glory to the world. Soon the entire world will tremble at the thought of Arstotska. Glory to Arstotska, sir and sirets. Back in a second. Oh, this is not a good start. We have started off in a boss battle in the worst possible position. The only way we're going to survive is very quickly ducking out of the way, but I doubt that's going to happen. Will we get away without being hit? We will. Sadly, at least one of the enemies is an SMG. I was hoping that perhaps if we were really lucky, both would be a, um, a plasma. That would be lovely. That would be every... Both of them are SMGs. Okay, that's annoyance. One seems to be a thruster stick, the other is an SMG tank. So both are pretty bad. Let's see if we can do some damage to him at least. Help out our teammates, maybe even take one of his guns, who knows. He seems pretty distracted, so I'm going to just volley into him. We are doing quite a lot of damage. I mean, that's not small damage. We've done a big chunk to him already. However, alas, our teammates were destroyed and thus I'll be the next target. But I'm going to go down the blaze of glory. Going to try and hit him as much as we can before we get taken out. We've already been hit a couple of times. My backwards wings have gone. So have I. Oh dear. However, he is. Oh, he got destroyed as well. We have did our part, sir and sirets. We kept him at bay. We did a lot of damage to him, and now only one enemy of the two remains. I'm assuming that was the tier 10 because the extreme high, the the high amount of SMG blocks. Not the best design, tier 10. Ah, team victory, glorious. Well. Wasn't the best of starts, but we were victorious, so there is a benefit there, certainly. Okay, then, let's go into another match as our daily win bonus. That was actually quite a lot for a tier 5 match. Let's get into another, hopefully not another boss battle. Uh, even in tier 6 you occasionally get boss battles, but at least it's rarer after you lot leave tier 3, tier 4. Tier 2 is riddled with them, which is a rather sad thing. Was it tier 3 that's riddled with them now? I know one of the, one of those two tiers have quite a few. 
Oh, I was about to say, do I have to skip? But apparently not. Hopefully, we will find some enemy bombers. And judging by the one enemy being called Tier 5 Plasma Bomber, we very well may have something to shoot at. Which is always a very good thing. So let's fly into the air with the greatest of ease. With the greatest of ease. Come on. There we go. I feel a bit slow at the moment, actually. I think I forgot some thrust or something. Um, I actually took this robot into tier 6 very briefly. Um, and due to that, I had to redo it again. I think I've lowered the amount of thrusters I've had. Or I've put too many... T oh, I know what I've done. Yep, I know what I've done right there. I have replaced some tier 5s with a couple of tier 4s on the bottom and on the top. And, of course, the more thrusters you have, the more um, diminishing returns you have. Oh, there's the bomber. He's already being shot at, though. Will I actually get to help out? Yeah, hit his shield twice. I mean, I mean, hitting his shield, that's a demoralizing thing. We have truly caused him to spin out like that. We have just broken his heart. What am I doing? Oops. <laughs> I may have um, pressed downwards thrust a little bit too much. We send us rocketing. There we go, upwards. Doing it again on purpose this time. There we go, got a kill. And yes, this is how I like to shoot, because it makes us look like the hawk. I just can't help myself. The big issue is, of course, if I'm going straight up, my controls lock up, and I eventually reach the, the height ceiling for this robot, which isn't particularly high. This is not a robot that's meant to do well, so interesting. It doesn't actually do badly, but it's there to look fun. There we go. I would say look good, but that would be a bit of a, um, a bit of an untruth. Oh, there's two bombers, but I'm going, I'm going to go after one that can still fight. Oh, we got railed, not sure where from. Both our wings got took out, so he hit pretty much the best place possible. An SMG tank there who took too long. Where is that rail? Is it a flyer rail? Uh, no. Well, uh, that was our, our end. We did get two kills, though, so I'm not upset by that. And the rail is going to... Oh, no, there's a healer, bugger. Backwards thrusters, go. Let's go towards him. We could possibly get back into the fight. Healer, I freaking love you. Thank you. Did I ever mention I adore healers? Healers, I respect, adore, and thank you for playing the... I want to say class. The class, the role you play. It truly is kind of you. Of course, some people just do it for the RP. You can get a lot of RP. Is that bomber trying to get in my way? Does he realise I can turn? I don't really know. Regardless, we did okay there. We took out up two bombers. Now, we, we need to sort out the me floating around thing, because that wasn't happening before, and I think it's... Oh, yes, that's what I've done as well. Two things I've done. Put these back in the wrong place. And under tier down here, which is a terrible idea. So let's just replace some of these, put them back as they were. Like that, okay. And that went on my seat as a bit of added protection. Let's just go into practice. Hopefully, we'll actually... Um, fly a little bit better. It did want to go up a bit then, I think. Sorry, it did want to, um... It didn't want to turn, is what I was trying to say there. Which was a little bit of an issue. Back up, and can we turn that? Oh, that's better. Yeah, already that's a million times better, okay. And, yeah, and we could even go straight up now, that locking. There we go, okay. All the problems are solved. Just a simple matter of redundant thrusters and thrusters in the wrong place. Okay, let's get into another match. Hopefully we'll do better than that. Not that we did badly. Not that we did badly. Like I've always said, my measure of success in, in Robocraft is quite low. As long as there is one kill, so as long as we've killed one enemy before we get killed ourselves, I see myself as a neutral entity in the world. I've gone through the world without making a ripple or causing a hindrance to our team. If we kill more than one, then we were a success and we have caused a positive influence for our team. So we were a positive influence. Try your best, and if you fail, you still tried your best. Do better next time. There we go. The one big issue is we are very heavy. Which, it makes that... Oh no, not that bug again. Please, not that bug again. Wow, I've never seen it just spawn in one block at a time. Why does this happen? Can anyone tell me in the comments why this occasionally happens? I've, I've looked up on Google and it seems like people, a lot of people just randomly get it and there's no correlation to what's causing it. Maybe I've been Googling the wrong places now. 
to help our survival, I'm going to be a bit less aggressive this time. We got lucky last time that there was no ground SMGs that found us quite so early. We're going to allow our teammates to go forward first. The hawk will remain back here circling its nest before eventually striking. But first, let, the, let our team take some of the punishment. Our bomber over there, who was aggressive, is showing us why we shouldn't do that. And is being, being handily dispatched. Okay, good. They're being distracted by our team. Oh, there goes that plasma tank. I was going to take a shot at, but it died too early. Did I get spotted? Oh, I did. Well, a lot of plasma tanks. I'm actually okay with this. Okay, let's get him who's high. Oh! I'm not okay with this anymore. One of them has a really good shot. Well done, sir. Did a lot of damage to him, though. Let's turn it back around. Oh, we've only lost... Good, we've only lost armor. This time we need to pay attention, because I wasn't paying attention at all to the people who were actually able to shoot me. I was just focusing on trying to kill someone. There we are. Crippled one, crippled another. We are a good teammate. Aha! You were the one who hit me last time, sir. You have got really good aim. I do commend you for your aim. However, I don't like the fact you are not on our enemy's team with this. I don't seem to have any medics, so that makes shooting that little that little crippled fellow less important. Because, well, when there's a lot of medics, killing off people completely is really important. I have been playing this rather dreadfully. Just die. Of course I am an interceptor, I'm not built for fighting um, ground, but still, I should have done better than that. I am deeply ashamed, but as always, I don't really cherry pick videos because, well, matches, because that would just be boring and a false kind of um, show of the robot I'm using. Hmm. I need downwards thrusters. If I had downwards thrusters, I could almost control this right now. Almost. Aha! I'm hitting you in revenge. I did a lot of damage, I'm okay with what happened. And I didn't die, so I'm still a neutral entity. Zero for zero. I will, I will forever be the neutral hawk. Oh, they've kind of blew up my beak as well. That's rather upsetting. I think what I did wrong there, let's analyse my failure. What I did wrong there was I was far too low. Far too low. I was kind of circling just above them, which made me a pretty easy target, actually. Wow, look all the people in tier 6 then. There were over 400. Possibly the tier 6 matchmaking is a little bit broke. We have the tier 4 on our side this time, so it's exactly the same as before, but um, flipped. Once again, allow our teammates to make their way up. But I would like to just um, state there that despite being hit by three plasmas, as in three plasma volleys, we did survive, and not too badly. So I'm, I feel that we've made quite a hardy um, vessel here. A center of blue and then a red wing defense on both sides makes wing knocking off a little bit harder. The only thing that normally does that is rails because it goes straight through the wings and that would happen regardless. What is causing this and why, th why are they so weirdly shaped this time? Look at it. Oh, that, that, that actually hurts my eyes being so close to that. Wow. Certainly something different. Oh, there's an enemy. An SMG hover. Okay, well, we, we hit it. Sometimes I do feel that um, over-tiered SMGs would help a lot, just because how little I can actually hit generally. Which is a mixture of flying makes you a little bit inaccurate, and I can't shoot for Taffy. I'm not being hit by someone who's him down there, thankfully, is, who is almost as inaccurate as us. How is he hitting us at the end there? Never mind, I took I take it back, he was better than me by a long shot. Oh, what's SMGs? How is he still hitting me? You little bastard, go away. Oh, that was just dreadful. Everyone's an SMG on their team. They even have one of those little um, thruster stick SMGs. That was actually just awful. We have like, no medics either, which is a terrible thing. Ah, oh, today is not a good day, sir and sir. Today is not a good day at all. Oh, they have a medic. I can't move. There is... Wow, there's just SMG tanks everywhere. That was not my sort of match at all. SMG tanks and healers. I didn't see an, any other kind of vehicle. Uh, see, that's the kind of battle you don't want to be in. As a flyer, of any as any kind of flyer. You want a more mixed enemy team, and with plasma bombers on their team. That's what you want if you're an interceptor. Oh, you are kidding me! Another boss battle today is cursed. How can two tier tens and a tier nine be matched against tier fives? Surely that's a tier six battle. Let me guess. Yeah, I'm always put here. Ugh. If even one of them's an SMG, I'm screwed, because I have to fly up to get backwards. I mean, I can move backwards, but so slowly. Just full turn as soon as we can, and go. There we are. 
Can we get away with having hit? Apparently we can. Okay, lovely. I have no faith in our team for winning this. Two tier 10s and a tier 9. That's really mean. That's brutal. At least one of them is a plasma, so I have a little bit more hope. For me, anyway. Not for our team still. Our team I still very, feel very scared for. I know they've got at least one SMG. At least I'm trying to climb a bit. Can you tell? So that thing touches, so much as touches me if it's plasma, I'm dead. There's the SMG. I could shoot it a little bit. It's a bit worrying to shoot it because I am basically telling them where I am. But killing that SMG is a necessary thing. Ah, humbug. Can we get at least a couple of good matches, please? Would it be so? Oops. There you go. Hopefully that won't cause too much an issue. I'm just going to have to restart the recording because I just accidentally minimised. <laughs> Back in a second. And we are back. I was far too lazy probably to edit out that last little section, so I'm just going to explain here. I may have accidentally minimised the screen, which can cause some issues with wraps, particularly with audio and random corrupting. So I just might have to check that everything was okay before carrying on, thankfully it was. Because who could lose such amazing matches like I've had so far? It would be a true crime to humanity and the Robocraft nation. Okay, let's see if we can do better this time. Plus less SMG. Okay, I'm still very confused. Um, can someone explain? Actually, no. I was looking up. Uh, yeah, I was looking up myself afterwards, but um, I was fairly sure that tier tens got matched up against. Well, at least more than one tier ten got got matched up against tier sixes and tier sevens in a boss battle. So two tier tens and a tier nine. I'm kind of surprised that got matched up against tier fives. Seems rather mean. Oh, there's a bomber. Which nobody spotted. I think. Yeah, that is a have a um, thruster stick, which we don't like, sir. Sir, we do not like at all. Because it because it does our job but better. So let's try and take it out in vain. Hopefully, we can actually, there we go. Took it out. So can we take out the bomber? That's the question. We're doing some damage to it. Doing more damage to it. Even more damage to it. But we're not killing it. Just slow down a little bit. There we go. Aha! Finally got a kill. So, regardless what happens now, we were a neutral entity in this universe. Did they all come back to try and get that fellow? Oh dear. Everyone's kind of crunched up into one section. Not the best of ideas, honestly. Oh, there's a bomber there, again. No one spotted, despite several people firing at it. That's a bit of a nuisance. Another bomber over there as well. Which I will spot. However, yep. Oh no, I thought it was out of range of my guns. Apparently it wasn't. It's taking evasive maneuvers. Oh, did it again. Let's get down. There we are, that's what I wanted to do. That way all my guns are showing and I can just do that. Oh, we took it out of the sky, that was the important thing. The plasma tank there. Oh, being shot by an SMG, not sure where from. Ah, from over there, okay. Nope, isn't... Is it you? No, you're a rail tank. Where's the SMG? Oh, who cares, I'm going to fire at this rail tank. Let's see if we can do some damage to it before it fires us. And once again, we've lost our wings. Was it in the air? Oh, it's a floater. Ugh, the joy of over tier SMGs. Okay, let's flip over. And let's see if we can enact horrible vengeance upon him. Yes, he's going down! There you go, we've completely crippled him. He's no longer useful to the enemy team. And we've even killed him. Today, we've enacted vengeance, Sir and Sirette. I feel very proud of our kill. Here comes a bomber. Now, I'm very vulnerable now. If he gets a good shot, I'm doomed. Thankfully, he's spinning, so good. Oh! Has he got helium? Yep, yeah, the helium's allowing him to do that. Well done. Good design. Allows you to um, keep in the fight even after you've been destroyed. So, well done that bomber there. That was a good shot. I was thinking about doing that myself, but um, it's not as good. It's not quite as good on the SMG since you can't really centralise the guns quite as much. So, when you end up floating, you generally end up floating with either no guns or one gun. See, that's a more balanced battle. Tier 9, Tier 9, Tier 8. Although we do have a Tier 1 on our team. <laughs> well, that's going to go well for him, I'm sure. Oh, I'll just drop something. People are laughing at me behind me. It's rather upsetting. It's just going straight to my ego. I'm just very upset now. Oh, that looks like an SMG. Yep, called it. SMG, call it. The Master Game. Ugh. Names like that make me cringe. Like the Master Gamer 101. 
Okay, so it's two SMGs, which one, one which I'm going to assume is the tier 8 because I've fast got taken out. And then one plasma, which I'm going to help work on now. We we hit a shield. I think that that clearly means we are we're the ones who are suit. We, we are the ones who were given victory, caused victory even. Ah, uh, SMGs, not the best. But we're not going to stay away from the fight. I do want to try and do some damage, help out the team. You never know. We can win this for the team, and everyone would be happy. I would like my sixth gun, honestly, since my fire rate is a little bit slower than it would be. I did, I did at one point have a sixth gun on the bottom where some of my thrusters are. It did help out my fire rate. Considering the inaccuracy that happens a lot of the time as an interceptor, that would be a good thing. Damn, that is one hardy hover. I think it's... Yeah, I think it's pretty much dead now, though. But that took a beating. How many plasma hits have hit it? It's just... There we go. That was good. Did a lot of damage to the enemies. To the enemy, really, since we touched the other two. I believe the SMG Walker got taken out very early on. Walkers never seem to do too well when it comes to the old boss battles. I think it's just because the legs are so vulnerable, it's very easy for them to be knocked off, and once they're knocked off, you're pretty much a sitting duck. Which is never nice, particularly on a boss battle with swarming robots. I still don't know what's causing us to... I think it's just my own gameplay that's causing us to flip upwards so easily and not go down. I think I simply need downwards thrusters. They would help out so much right now. Oh, on this map again, but we've had such bad luck on this map. No, nope, no, nope, saying that, the last time killing that, that floating um, SMG was very nice. Ah, uh, look. Well, at least you're on our team, sir. At least you're on our team. Onwards to glory. So, what are we going to do then? Ooh, that's a very nice looking... That's a beautiful looking gun bomber. It looks a bit frail, but it looks gorgeous. Oh, that is that is really pretty. Go you, sir. You've made something which looks really nice. I approve. I approve with all of my soul. Now, will there be enemy bombers, and, uh, and will they be so aggressive? Oh, there's definitely an enemy rail. Thank you for letting me know that, sir. Oh, he's going down. Oh, he's going so quickly down. And he's on the floor. That was quick. Oh. Good. Well, he missed at least. There's a plasma who's coming round. Let's. Oh, well, our teammates went that way. I thought they'd gone that way for some reason. Okay, stick with our teammates. Um, try and duck until that spot goes away. Because honestly, if you're spotted as a flyer, probably don't want to. Um... Oh my! What? Look at that! Wasn't even aiming at us and it hit us. Oh, SMGs everywhere, and I'm going into another SMG by going this way. I've already lost two of my guns. Well, one of my guns. Now I've lost two of my guns. Oh, that was just dreadful. Just SMGs again everywhere. I just didn't know what to do. I was overwhelmed with inputs of sense. You know. I wonder. Trink will come after me. Do you think he will just continue with the battle? He'll probably go after. No, no, he won't. Okay, he's an honourable sir. He's not going to go after the poor crippled fellow. Oh, I should, I should be able to fly still. I have a gun. I have two guns. Okay, we're back up in the air then. No, we're not dead yet. I honestly thought uh, we have lost our backwards rudder though, so our controls are going to be really, really screwy. And we've only got two guns, which aren't over-tiered. Uh, that's not going to do well. There's a rail flyer. We got, we hit him once, then lost one of our guns. Our unpredictable movement saved us from the second shot, I think. I feel. He's trying to take cover. I don't think he realises I have no... Um, no other gun. Sir, you really don't need to take cover from me. You may as well finish me off. Put me out of, Go on, put me out of my misery already. No. Also, no. That's not quite what I had in mind there. I think I will deny him the kill like a true douche. Oh, no. We have no power at all. Oh, no. We can still move. We're now a makeshift thruster stick. Can we self-destruct before they reach us and salvage our valuable uh, information from the Ostotska military? We can. Okay, that's the important thing, though. Ah, dreadful. Um, so what I'm thinking is this. Ah, if I don't want to just flip one. Okay, there we go. We have at least one downwards thruster. Let's continue. This will be the last match of today. Such bad luck. Honestly, um, during the stream and during um, 
testing it out before I turn it into a tier 6. I was doing so well, but I've clearly screwed something up in controls, but not only that, I've been playing dreadfully. I've been far too low, and I've been doing, like, basically suicide runs. In addition to this, not having my sixth gun, I feel, is a bit of a mistake. I think after this episode, I'm going to go off and perhaps change it a little bit more. Yeah, I feel that I'll change it a little bit more and the that the end result will be the end result. But right now, I don't like how it is. Maybe even a good on top. Ugh, it might be a better idea. The shape does not lend itself well to this. It must be said, just because of how heavy everything is, it's, it's almost impossible to put enough thrusters on and keep the same shape. And still have enough guns to, you know, work. But that's that. Um, hopefully we can do something in the future. I'm going to let my teammates go far... Actually, why don't... What, what, ah, bomber. I was going to say, why don't we go to the mountain? There's sure to be bombers coming up there. And as I said that, I saw a bomber, so... There we go. Okay, he's down and out. Okay, that's an interceptor. Hopefully we can out-intercept his intercepting. Which we can. Goodbye. That's two flyers, which we can... Taken out of the sky. And a third, which simply got destroyed. A fourth? Oh. Air superiority for Ostotska. That's a medic flyer. You, sir, need to stop firing at me, because I didn't even know where you was until then. And we've actually taken him out of the sky as well. So we've crippled four planes at the very start of the game. Killed one, crippled all the rest. Even if I get killed now, I feel like I've definitely done my job and more. Is he still there? He's still there, okay. He still has the ability to fire, so I need to be a little bit careful. Never consider an enemy down and out until he's actually dead, because... Oh, did he return to Mothership? Oh no, there he is. Damn, I thought he returned to Mothership. I was going to leave him alone. Oh, the medic's trying to help out on the flyers. Let's try and stop. put a stop to that. There we are. Took out him, and let's take out the medic if we can. I know you were just doing your job, and I did say how much I love medics like seconds ago. However, you're not on our team, and thus I do have to take you out. Okay, that's a good match. Uh, is that what's left of the interceptor? Is that a, no, that's, that's a hover. Okay, it's a very fast hover. Who apparently can't shoot. I've actually lost several of my guns in the... I'm going to lose to this, by the way. I just want to put it out there. Trying to aim for the guns, but it's not happening. And sadly, we're taken out. I could have simply avoided the battle, but... Um, oh. Loving the extremely over-tiered guns there, sir. That explains why you're so small. They were at minimum tier 7s. In fact, I think they were exactly tier 7s. Yeah, let's see. Yep, tier 7 SMGs. Darn, that did a lot of damage to me. Simply gutted the back. Okay, well, I feel like I did very well there, so I'm happy with that anyway. Not good against ground things, just haven't got the firepower. I do think I need my sixth gun back, and I think I'm going to put it here. Simply to fight. Since I seem to get into more ground battles than air battles, so I think maybe just a gun there might help. Of course, what I've just done is... A, get myself into tier 6, and B, weaken my thrust even more. So I'll have to look at that. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the episode, Sir and Sir. I haven't done too badly. Didn't do exceedingly well, but I feel that I've done okay. I have, resist I have resisted the temptation to go over-tiered, and the design, of course, like I said, due to its cumbersome design, because of the shape we we're going for, has been a little bit difficult to get some speed going without over tearing the thrusters and such. So, I hope you've enjoyed. If you have any suggestions to how I can make it a little bit more deadly, then of course comments are more than welcome. I will probably be posting another video in the finished version in the future. So thank you for watching Sir and Sir. I hope you've enjoyed the video and hope to see you next time. Likes, comments, favourites and shares, all extremely welcome, including subscribing. So thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Do take care.